I am a real victim of Jeffrey Epstein. The reason you don't see me in the news is because I am a real victim. Real victims are not being represented by attorneys or in the media. I was trafficked to Jeffrey Epstein and Andrew Windsor by Deborah Palfrey, the DC Madam. I was a student at the Catholic University of America in Washington, DC in 2002. I answered an ad in the city paper. The ad was ambiguous. Deborah was professional. I thought I was going on a real job interview. Instead, I was drugged and raped by Paul Hung. I tried to tell Deborah what happened, but something she said made me realize she knew what happened. At that point, they had my driver's license, and I did not know what to do or where to go for help. At that point, I was driven by Jonathan Luna to the Bethesda Marriott in, on Pooks Hill, where Jeffrey Epstein and Andrew Windsor drugged and raped me. I have tried to get help. I called the police. I was abducted for two weeks. I was moved from Washington, D.C. by Ed Norris, who was the superintendent of the Maryland State Police. He is now an actor on the show The Wire and has a radio show. My name is Jessica Collins. I live in Virginia. Today is September the 3rd, 2019. If anything happens to me, it's because this information is true and I have a lot more information about who I was trafficked to in the government, people who are in the White House today. If you could redistribute this video, please save it and redistribute it. If anything happens to me, at least I have this out. I have been threatened. My car was disabled by a government employee when the Jeffrey Epstein news broke. I have been without a vehicle for 40 days. Um, I don't know what else to say. Please save this video. Please redistribute it. Please try and spread it. There is no way that this is going to get out there in the media unless we, the American people, do the work. The government is involved, and I was trafficked for nearly 17 years. Please try to help by redistributing this, tweeting it, talking about it. I'll do everything that I can. Thank you for listening. I hope that together we can get to the bottom of this and hold the criminals accountable.